Jo Young Sook is a South Korean actor. Jo Young Sook had always wanted to be on a stage. He was admitted into the theater department of Seoul Institute of the Arts on student loan, but after his father died in 2000, Jo's widowed mother became fully dependent on him. He was granted an exemption from military service due to family circumstances and he quit school before graduating so he could start earning money by doing musicals. He made his professional acting debut in The Nutcracker in 2004. In 2011, he landed his first television role on cable series What's Up as an awkward but talented music student. But 2012 would be his breakout year, staring in two high-profile projects. In his big screen debut, he played a supporting role in box office hit Architecture 101. Joe has been in a relationship with singer Gummy since 2013. In June 2018, it was announced that Joe would marry Gummy in fall. On October 8, 2018, news broke that the couple got married privately. On January 6, 2020, Gummy's agency confirmed that she was seven weeks pregnant with the couple's first child. On August 6, 2020, Jo Young Sook and wife Gummy welcomed their first daughter. In 2020, Jo starred in the medical drama hospital playlist as one of the main roles as an assistant professor of general surgery. In 2019, Jo starred in the historical drama Nugdu Flower. In 2018, Jo was cast in the action thriller film Hit and Run Squad in which he took a role as an antagonist as well as the disaster action film Exit. In 2017, Joe was cast in the gangster thriller The Drug King, directed by Oh Min Ho. The same year, he made his small screen comeback in NBC's fantasy comedy drama Two Cops. In 2015, Joe played an arrogant star shape who falls for his kitchen assistant who has been possessed by a virgin ghost in Oh My Ghost, which was a commercial and critical hit. He also headlined the exclusive Beat the Devil's Tattoo in which he played a TV news reporter who gets a scoop followed by the time-hopping thriller Time Renegade. Joe appeared in two films in 2014, the period thriller The Fatal Encounter where he played an assassin targeting Kim Jong Jo and the romantic comedy My Love, My Bride, a remake of the same titled 1990 hit in which he and Shin Min are played a newly married couple. In 2016, Joe played an announcer in SBS romantic comedy Don't Dare to Dream, who falls for a weather announcer, played by Gong Hyo Jin. The series was a hit and led to increased popularity for Jo, who then became one of the most in-demand actors in the industry. He then headlined the comedy drama film My Annoying Brother alongside Park Shin Hae and Do Kyung Soo of EXO. The film topped box office charts and earned positive reviews for Jo, who was praised for his comedic timing and chemistry with Koesta Do. In 2011, he landed his first television role on cable series What's Up as an awkward but talented music student. But 2012 would be his breakout year, staring in two high-profile projects. In his big screen debut, he played a supporting role in box office hit Architecture 101.